Hey guys, welcome back, and today I just got a new Marvel at 40 ph This time, I'm not going to work on it, but it says Amtrak at 40 ph number phase 3, 410 with ditch rights. That sounds good. And much to mention, um, and it looks like it's similar like 359 and 316's model. But I'm going to make a comparison of them. Well, let's get straight out of the box. Let's get straight out of the box. There is a FOEPH instruction mode, as, as I can see. And there is a parts found that got assembled. A sticker, a mother sticker. And one percent gray day. Let's take it out. We should get able to get the engine out. And I'm trying to remember three ten is more like a comparison to three fifty nine that I got and three sixteen. Which is kind of a Will be smallest if I had so far. Let's take it out. Fail. Let's try this again. You have been waiting for the M Trank F40 PH number 310. And this work mode it does have a dead strikes, similar to a 406 that I currently had. That does have a horn sound. And strobe lights and the marker lights too. Pretty much couplings. It does have a have some fans so I can to compare with waffles. And yeah. It does have um they were the same models as 359 and 316, but they are different models. Let's take it out. Man, we got our first ever HL scale ditch rider at 40 pH. Last year it was a uh, last few years, I just got an old scale, which is 406, kind like a similar ditch rider. FYPH, and now we got this. Pretty interesting comparison. Now we got three FYPHs that are still in a lot of HL scale today. Let's test it out and let's see if it will work. Here's some bells and horn sounds. Maven P5, which is a Devon horn, P5A. M5, K5OA, Mother Maven P5s, and some Amtrak K5LAs. Here's some functions of that too. Pretty interesting. Want to mention on M3, there's a double effect. Let's place a brand new M3 page on the track. Not to mention, there's some boogies that are realistic. Look at that boogies. That looks like a, like a base on a train Z or something like that. Let me take a thumbnail shot of this awesome locomotive. It does have a background like 310 R. Let's get the action going. Prepare for a test. First one of Amtrak at 40 pH number 310. Alright, let's begin the test one.
I want to get some more function so I um love us at 40 pinch from a 355 and 59 which way will be uploaded but I'm the archive unboxings but it does have a fun headlight let's power up wait hold on what's stop the engine F6, F1 is a fun light, which is already turned on. F1, which is a bell. Wait a second, it activates globes, too. This is awesome. Horn and bell, like a uh, similar to Train Z model, like in Jordan Wales, Bill Den, start by TRS-19. Here goes nothing. Ooh, it's a K5LA horn. Let's turn the dead right so let's see what happens. Pretty cool. Also, I can see the trackside lights are on. In case there's a mind blow on, on it. F10 was already have strobe lights or were just installed. Let's give a test run going. So Thomas will be your chaser. Let's give it a go. This is a faster D fastest DCC way DCC engine of my way of my collection. Let's get excelling Thomas for a little bit. Time for a dumbbell horn, which is on F3. my feature. Let's try it again. Never mind. I like this little feature down there. Oh. Here comes the one by. Let's accelerate! Thomas is accelerating too! Time for double horn. Pretty awesome.
Mars trying to get this distance. Nope, not going to be impacting them while. Very cool. Mama Queen. Yeah. Okay, Miss Emergency Marker, which is still on. Let's get some VHS shots. Let's do a bit of Bomba now. Let's pull the Apple APH into a great stop. What did I think of this model? This model went great. It used to be a production of this FOE page back in 2010. Back in, like, way to 2010s. Or something like that. Let me give a capture of that one for a thumbnail for now. My opinion of this engine is very stylish. To be honest, it does have a P5 as a, as a White Maven K5 away horn. It does an emergency horn. It does have a strobe lights too. Like I said, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you again next time. Peace out, whale fans. Thank you.